How's it going guys? My name is Alex and welcome back to Elosis. So we're going to go ahead and just jump back right into this because I have found, I found all the other missing pieces, which I was going to like just show of where the stuff is, but, uh, I just didn't see no point of it because, uh, let's see, all the pieces are in place now. Ooh, what the hell is this? Strange shape of metal I am found inside the temple. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Here. Ha ha ha. Yeah. And I fight. Oh, what are we taking off of them? There is only a key in his pocket. Okay, this probably might go to the church. The only key I found the man. Okay, that should go to the church. Okay. Let's see what we got. So we're going to go to that church. And I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be some kind of hidden passage. Okay. I'm pretty sure I'll meet it downstairs. So I think it was that man with the torch. I hope it was so I don't have to worry about him ever again. Let's see. Get that out of inventory. Okay, let's do this. Off to the church we go. Okay, there it is. Which hopefully this uh, key will fit through it. Which I'm assuming this key will fit. Right. All right, cool. Oh. Ah, secret hatch. It's sealed, it has no handle. Okay. Oh, screwdriver. Gotta make use of that. Oh, yeah. All right, here I go. Oh man, okay, I'm kind of a little terrified what's going to be happening down here. <laughs> chapter 3, The Awakening. Man, Chapter 2 though, that was a very long bud of a chapter. <gasps> oh, no turning back now, huh? They sealed the hatch. I need to find another way out. Alright. Okay, nothing. Skeleton. There's nothing. Okay. This is some very strange type of thing going on here. Ooh. What is that? A wooden staff? Don't know why I need with a wooden staff. I'm going to hang on to that. Oh, I guess I'm going to do that. There's a lot of moisture in here and a horrible stench. Oh, what? 
Let's see, what the hell is this? I need to run. <laughs> oh. Come on. Come on. Run! Run, 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 run! Come on, go, 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 go. And... Jump! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Man, I really love this stuff. It looks like, this kind of reminds me of Temple Run. If you guys ever play Temple Run, then you guys are real people. You guys have not played Temple Run, well, you guys are kind of missing out. Woo! Oh, nice way to sweep in. Okay, now the fact of the matter is, how are we going to get out of here? Ooh. Over there. It's a, it's a robe I better wear to avoid getting noticed. Okay, who's going to notice me here? That's the biggest question. Okay. So I got this little metal artifact here. I'm not so sure what this is supposed to do, but... I guess I'll find out as soon as I get to wherever I'm going. Huh. What's this? It's her. She is one of them. But she is. And here is the catalyst. I see that you are ready for the ceremony. You look surprised. I guess you don't have a clue about what's going on. No. Nope. Let me enlighten you. Okay. You are one of us. Just as your father and your mother were. Since you were born, you were meant to be the vessel for the Alephsis of the Great Alephsis. Your father tried to keep you away from us. He made sure that you and your mother would remain hidden. It took us years to track her down. When we did, we only had to wait for the right time. That time came when she wrote the letter asking you to visit her. Then we led you here and tested you. So, you you're the one who did that rock and thing. Proved that you really are the chosen one. All you have to do now is enter the pit. Then you will feel the great power of Typhoeus burning through your every cell. You will become a god. The power to shape reality will You're be yours, insane. So don't hesitate. Taste the power and redeem this world. Um Here's the thing, we're not ready for that type of thing, so... Well, wait a minute, so I do have a choice. Either jump in the pit or throw this. Throw this. I'll feel godly enough. No! What have you done? You've ruined everything! This place will soon collapse, I have to get out. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. Go, 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 go. As I saw the cave collapse, I realized that my life would never be the same again. Since my birth, I had been chosen to be the one that would hold the power to either change or preserve the world as we know it. I saw and experienced things that up until now, I believed only existed in fiction. I know now that there are forces lurking hidden in our reality that we are unaware of as we are occupied by our daily life. These forces are constantly trying to enter our world. It's up to us whether to let them in or not. Ooh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> well, that was cool. I don't know if I made the right decision, but... Hey, I'm gonna go back and actually check to see about the, um... I'm gonna check that, like, what, what happened if I did jump into the pit. So I'll be right back, guys. So I'm here now. I'm gonna, like, uh... I want to see what happens if I did jump into the pit. So, here we go. 
Geronimo! Whee! At first, there was darkness and silence. Then I felt a levitating sensation, like, like I was pulled towards something. In front of me, I saw a bright white light filling me with warmth. As I accelerated towards it, I felt my human existence melting away. And at the same time, a new kind of awareness was born inside me. I knew that my own body could not handle that power, but I didn't care anymore. A new existence had arisen filled with power beyond imagination. <sighs> now I have the power to shape the world according to my own will. Okay. Well, dang, okay, that's what happens when I become a god. So, pretty much, I kill myself and then I get reborn as some type of a godly being. Which I'm starting to think, I mean, really doesn't look like anything changed. So yeah, that was pointless, so thank you all so much for watching, and if you guys really enjoyed this, leave a like and comment, do not forget to subscribe if you guys have not yet. This was a really awesome game, this was, this was really tricky, but yeah, like, awesome kind of a game, so I'll definitely put a link in the description below so you guys can try this game out for yourself. So yeah, definitely, thank you all so much for watching again, and I will see you all in the next video.